Are you going to pick up Santil Danpo? Most definitely, day one bite. I like the look of Santil Danpo. Anything involving rain in a horror game sets, sets me up quite well. I like rain. Game coming out called Binary Domination. Looks great. Mm, I'll keep my eyes open for that. Right, dudes, my smoke's done, so um, let's get in there. Another half an hour or something like that, and then I'll um, go for a break. I know I had a little break there, like, but I, I need, like, a full, full break. <laughs> right, let's get back in there. Oh, wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. You know what? It's Steve. Spray the fuckers down. Oh, I got two. I got two. What's that? Grenade rounds? I'm not picking up no grenade rounds on Steve. It's a shutter here. A card reader, indigo in blue colour. It's electronically locked, meaning I cannot get in there yet. Door here? Oh, you can go in that door. Okay. Oh. Way too close. Oh my god, what a pro! Oh, they're still alive! I don't like the look of that green shit pumping out of that pipe. Let's test it on that zombie first. Oh, 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 okay, he's fine about it. I bet Steve's not gonna be fine just walking through it. Oh, we're down to 34%. I don't think he wanted me to shoot absolutely everything. Tough shit though, isn't it? <laughs> everything is getting shot. It's a machine used for ventilation. It seems to have been in use for a long time. Oh, it's on the other end, yeah. It's on the other side of that um, stepladder where Alfred was shooting at me. Caution, breaker may fail due to overload. In case of failure, raise the lever as illustrated. Ventilation device will resume operation. Hook it up. Oh, okay. It's part, it's part of the wall. Shit myself almost then. I'm like, what the fuck is that? It's cut out of the wall, Sand Hill style. Hey, Claire. I managed to clear a path for you. It should be safe now. Sweet, I saved loads of ammo then, I'm gonna do that myself. Well, what do you think of my work? Not bad. If I say so for myself. You see? This thing is a lot more reliable than any person. Oh, he's often got family and friend issues. People? Steve. What were you doing here? Who brought you here, and where is your family? Shut up! I don't want to talk about it! And that's the last 30% of the clip. Steve. Never mind. Let's get going. Fair enough. Elevator to where? Oh, and he's run off now. He didn't say in the elevator, I'm gonna have, you know, I've thrown an absolute massive tantrum now, I'm gonna run away. It's like, it's just an elevator, like, yeah, you know, not bad music and stuff like that, and how, how was your day? We're having some decent weather. Run! As soon as the door open. Rude motherfucker. Oh no, he's there. Okay, cool. <laughs> oh, the shit! <laughs> I didn't expect that. <laughs> Claire, are you okay? No, shit him. Steve, behind you. No. Oh, yeah, I remember. Is it his dad or something like that? He's doing a Leon. I can't. I can't. I just can't. Bow gun. Bow gun. Knife. Anything. What's he doing?
I didn't leave you that much ammo, actually. <laughs> Sprays about 200 fucking bullets near Claire. Oh, I'm gonna faint. Wouldn't surprise me. Father. 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 Yeah, poor dude. Dad. I used to work for Umbrella. I tried to steal information, intending to sell it off to the highest bidder. He was caught. Mom was killed. We were sent here. Oh, Steve. He was a fool to do something so reckless. So stupid. It's okay now. Just rest. I couldn't fucking rest next to no smelly zombie, I, I gotta be honest, it would fucking stink. You know really, there should be a mechanic in zombie games where some zombies are just so fucking foul, you can't even get near them without them just like, oh, fucking gagging. I should leave him alone for now. You should leave him alone for now. You don't want to do anything that might provoke him or, you know, be um, unkind to him. Stop the motherfucker! Nah, it doesn't work. He's intangible. I hate it when people become intangible because they're grieving. I don't get that. There's just no need. Grieve. Don't go intangible. That's just rude. Rude. What's this? A large size relief. The imagery appears to be telling a legend. Well, what legend? If it appears to tell a legend, how about telling me the legend? I'm interested. I want to know what the legend is. I can't believe there's nothing to loot out of the car. That just seems strange to me. I don't buy this. There's got to be something to loot out of the car. It's under repair. I can't drive it. I didn't say to drive it. No, oh, whatever. Oh, well. Out we go. Oh, shit. No, it doesn't count. Oh, thank fuck. Ah, for going intangible while picking up bogans. No. You unlock the door? Didn't lock that door. Let's have a scout out for items first. Please don't be dogs around here. An old tank is being displayed here. This could be suited to Alf- what? This could be suited to Alfred's taste. Is it suited to Alfred's taste? Is it not suited to Alfred's taste? Or are you just saying, you know, if you give it some you know, red stripes down there, maybe, I don't know, like a couple of crests, the Alfred family crest, maybe gold out a little bit, then maybe it could be suited to Alfred's taste. At the moment though, oh, oh my god dog, how busy suiting it to Alfred's taste there? No, I'm not getting it twice. I'm not getting it twice. Oh, not that thing. No. No. Wait a minute. Back in the room. Let's go back in here, see if anything's different. No, it's locked again now. Do I still have my card? What, what is this card? Ah. It's literally locked. Yes. Bring that up. And... Oh, I need to ventilate it first before it can be released. I really wanted to save and I need a box. Oh, I need to go get an item box. And there's no chest, is there? The first chest. Oh, it's red up there. I need to get to a chest and I think the closest one is going to be around here. So get to the trunk. I'll drop down a save just for sheer insurance. Dogs! I wonder if they have to press X to go up steps or if they just run straight up there. 
Right, so... Ah, yeah, everybody on the stream has the, um, the same idea of what I've got here. This card's going a long way. Right, which, it was this door, was it not? Right, so... Let's go to the chest, we'll get the hemostatic out, we'll drop down a save... And... We'll go try save that guy, see what see what's um, gonna happen with him. I don't need those Lugas in my inventory, I know that for a fact. Swap it out with that. Don't need the Red Herb on me. The Bogan can be combined. Take an Ink Ribbon. Right. Oh, you gotta, you gotta approach the typewriter from the correct side, otherwise you cannot type. Okay, yes. Well, may as well start saving over one now. Yes. There we go. And into the chest. Dump the ink ribbon. Start stacking them. No, no, you never stack ink ribbons when you get them down to one. You are a moron. You got plenty. Oh my god, Resident Evil Rule 101. If you take a stack down to one, don't combine them because you might want to carry one on you at some point. Fool. You are a fool, sir. Right, back out of this room. Right, so I think we can go back the same way we've just come to this room. Should be okay. I've got to run past a couple of dogs, but I think we're okay on health. Yeah, we're fine. So back out the way we've just come, and we need to go back to the beginning of the game almost. It's not as far as it sounds, though. It's not. No dogs. Not today. Oof, almost. I don't think I've actually... You know what? I honestly don't think I actually pressed on the door then, but it let me in, so I'm not going to complain. I'm not going to complain. Hopefully, yeah, fear guy. He's run off now. He's run off. <laughs> he knows I can get out of there regardless. He only ever blocks me when he knows that I actually can't get that way permanently. If he knows I can actually get in a way around, there's no point blocking me, is it? Just no point. Do not like this area. I don't know what that door does over there, but... I'm not... I just don't want to find out at the moment. Not with that worm following me. Right, so, back down here. Back down here. Ka-chunk! Chunk! Chunk! Bit delayed. I remember this place. It seems like ages ago we were here, but it wasn't only about an hour and a half, two hours ago. Tops. Oh, wrong way. Yeah, it was only about an hour and a half, two, top, uh, two tops. And I still don't know the way properly. Did I actually leave a herb there? Or did I go back and get it? Oh, I think I went back and got it, didn't I? Wait a minute, what's this? Oh, doors, no, nah, do those doors don't work. Don't seem like they're ever going to work. Right, if memory serves correct, isn't there some zombies in here? I think there's some zombies. Yes. That's okay. <laughs> not even one, not one of them that acknowledged my existence there. So I was either very fast and very stealthy, or they'd... What? You can't respawn? So I've got to kill all these again. Oh, there's not as many though. Just the one. You son of a... No. Get down onto the floor again and die. There we go. Did he actually hurt me by doing that? No. But that's it. You know what? I can get around you. <laughs> oh, he's fast! Holy shit, did you see that zombie move? He wanted me. Wow. Huh. <laughs> The other ones didn't acknowledge my existence. That guy really wanted me. I don't think I did this in time before. I'll remember it when, when, when I don't know if something unfolds that I don't recognise. Then yeah, that'll get me answer if I um, did it or not. 